What's going on everybody? Josh Engelman here for stochastic.com. We've been getting a lot of questions. How do I upload my lineups? I've created a bunch of lineups in our Sims tool or in the lineup generator. I have this CSV, what do I do with it? Well, this is what you do on DraftKings and FanDuel to upload the lineups that you've created. First, we're starting on DraftKings. You can see I've got it pulled up on the screen. I am gonna go to lineups at the top. And then I'm gonna show you what I've done so far. I have already registered for a contest. I have four lineups entered and I just have a dummy lineup. You can see it on the screen. A lot of those guys you shouldn't be playing. I'm going to take the lineups that I created in the Sims tool at stochastic.com and upload them to DraftKings so that I could edit it and have the correct players. So right now what you see is the next step, which is clicking the edit entries button. And this is going to take us to the landing page that we need. You can see that we can download and upload files from this page. And the first thing that we need to do is download the template from DraftKings that contains our four lineups. So I'm going to click the download button and I'm going to save this file and then I'm gonna open it and show you what it looks like. Now I've zoomed in a little bit, but this is what the file looks like. I have opened it in Microsoft Excel. You can open it as well in Google Sheets if you don't have Excel. This process will be largely the same, but the way you save things and re-upload may be a little bit different. But this is the process using Excel. You'll see it in the same basic way in Google Sheets. You see the four lineups that I've created. They're represented on each individual row. There's contest IDs. It shows you the contest name. This is what the DraftKings template looks like. And you see the same lineup in all four lines. What I wanna do is take the CSV export from stochastic.com sim tool and use those lineups to copy them into this file and re-upload to DraftKings. So now I've just run the sims tool. I'm going to upload the lineups that I generated. So this is what the file looks like coming out of the sims tool. Now on the screen, you see four lineups, but you don't see the contest information and you see different players across the board compared to what we saw before. This is the file that came from Stochastic. So I'm gonna grab all four rows, all the way from quarterback to defense, and I'm gonna copy that information. Now we're gonna hop back to the template file from DraftKings. Now we're back in the template file. I'm going to paste these lineups over the dummy lineups that I have created. And you can see now they are updated in the template. I need to save this template and now re-upload it to DraftKings. And that is what we will do on this screen. I'm gonna click the upload button, find that template file, upload it here, and you'll see successfully uploaded four of four lineups, but we wanna double check. So I'm gonna click on the lineups button. And now you'll see four unique lineups across the board instead of the one dummy lineup. This is how you export lineups from Stochastic and upload them to DraftKings. The FanDuel process is the exact same, which we'll do right now. So here you can see that we're on FanDuel. This process is going to be basically the same. I entered one dummy lineup on FanDuel. We're gonna update it with the information from Stochastic. So I'm gonna click Upcoming. And when I do that, you will now see the dummy lineup that I have entered. I am going to click the button that says CSV edit. Now this entire process is going to look identical to what we just did. I'm gonna click download a CSV template and I'm gonna save that file and open it. This is what we need to edit in order to re-upload to FanDuel. Now you'll see this template looks just like the DraftKings template. You see contest ID, the contest name, you see all the player IDs and the positionality. This is what we need to copy over. So I'm going to export my lineups from Stochastic, whether you're using the Sims tool or the lineup generator, or if you're using some other tool, it's the same process. You want to open up that CSV and copy your lineups from one file to the other. On the screen right now, you see the lineup that I want to use on FanDuel. This is what I generated in our Sims tool. I'm going to copy this lineup, paste it into the template file from FanDuel, and re-upload that file to override my previous lineup. So you can see on the screen right now, I have pasted over my previous dummy lineup, and now it actually contains Real players, Austin Eckler, Josh Allen, Jalen Warren, I've got the Bengals D, who else do we see here? Uh, Tyler Boyd, we got the real names in there. Remember, the FanDuel lineup was filled with a bunch of dummy players. So I'm gonna save this template 
and re-upload it to FanDuel. Now we're back on the upload page for FanDuel. I'm gonna click choose file and I'm going to upload the template that we just edited. Click edit. You can see one entry updated successfully. Now you still see the dummy lineup on the screen. If I click refresh, now you see the lineup that we added. So this is how you edit a CSV to update your lineups from the Sims tool and upload them to DraftKings and FanDuel. Now the process for Yahoo or Owner's Box, it's going to be basically the same. You're just going to different pages to handle it, but you're copying lineups from one file to another and then re-uploading. If you have further questions, please email support at stochastic.com. We're happy to help you out.